Yeah, I know what you're going to say. I'm at the same place, King Carl Willa Park. Just killing a bit of time before I go to the uh, testing station for the bike. Had a very wet 15 hours. Started raining at four o'clock yesterday. Heavy, I got drenched. And it looks like uh, they're not going to open today. I think it's going to rain most of the day. It's been raining for the last, well, like I said, but I was at the coffee shop waiting for it to stop. Luckily it has for the moment. River's up a little bit more. Not a lot. Around a bit. Very, uh, very wet underfoot. How's that for a nice light? And where this dog come from? It's following me around. I hope nobody thinks it's mine because I'm not supposed to have pets in here. It's got a collar and a, and a, a disc. It's quite friendly, come up sniffing and basically saying hello, there he goes. Looks like a wolf. Nice colour. Those birds soon cleared off when he went down there. I've never seen those before, they're gorgeous. Look, big white, they look, I thought they were blooming swans, obviously not, but they're not as big, but. I have no idea what they are. They're coming a little bit closer. I don't understand why the river the river's so um, brown. Never seen it like this before. Unless they're working upstream and the the mud's being stirred up. They're just ducks. Tied ducks. Yeah, no fishermen out. Down on where you see that change in the water where it goes sort of rapid over that bank, usually you get fishermen along there. But this uh, hasn't been any for days. I suppose it's too deep, too risky. Actually, to be honest, I think the water's gone down because those two landing stages on a video I did the other day were underwater. So yeah, it has, it's gone down. I'm not gonna walk all the way round. If anybody's interested in um, any of the history there's a guy on youtube i used to watch him before and he disappeared for some time but i've noticed he's back he's down in the south he's actually based in chiang mai or his profile says he is glenn willett it's called willett's world on youtube if you want to know history about temples or anything he seems to study it all and tell it's quite interesting he hasn't got as many followers as i thought because I quite enjoy sort of all the things he tells you. It's, you know, it saves me looking anyway. I've only just learned how to um, read on uh, it, that's King Carl Willa. And he was down there and there was about eight kings dating back centuries. And there was one that looked like him, but it wasn't him. So he was obviously just up in this area, I don't know. That's Fort Carwilla. This is so immaculate because it's looked after by the troops. The land's owned by them actually. 
33rd Military Circle, it says. The 7th Infantry Regiment over there. I see them over here a lot, and they're always okay. Some speak English, and I'll have a chat with you. I am literally the only person, I've never seen this park so empty. But it's nice. Have a wander around, talking to yourself. Gee, I love this country. Absolutely love it. If all goes well next year when I uh, renew my visa, I think it's, uh, although I'm 71, people say, oh, but you're old. If you die over there, what will happen? Well, when I'm dead, I couldn't give a monkey. I just love being here. It's just so relaxed. I just spent a great, what, almost two hours down at the coffee shop talking to numerous nationalities, everybody chats and gives you information. I met a guy, a German guy, who actually lives in the same place I do, he's been there five years. We were talking about motorbikes and I said I was looking for the same one. He's got a PCX and sadly they'd sold it, so I bought another one. But it's a nice bike. Same CC, just smaller. I was shocked when I filled it up, yes, it took so much fuel, it must have a massive tank on it. I don't mind, I'll go on forever on that. Right, I've got to go down near that big tall building over there, the transportation office I've got to go to and meet a mechanic who's going to put my bike through all the, the test. <laughs> Well, if you can call it that, cost 60 bar. And the guy just rides it for about, well, literally 10 seconds. Yeah, that's all right, bang, in it goes. Imagine living like that, eh? Just makes Asia, though, doesn't it? Without that, it wouldn't be anywhere near the fun it is. That's the temple up there where I was yesterday and the um, Ping River cruise boats. I may put this video up, I don't know. I've done this place so many times, but then I just like being here, it's nice. Much better on a sunny day. Oh, well, that's enough. I'll uh, decide when I review it. Cheers.